Hello, my name is Joe Lurie. I'm a senior product manager with the Microsoft Customer Acceleration Team. Welcome to the Windows 11 release notes for July 2024. Today, we're showing you how to save time working with files and folders in File Explorer. Let's start with a few highlights from this month's update, some of which are rolling out gradually and may not be available for your device just yet. With this month's update, the Show Desktop button once again appears in the taskbar by default. To change this in other taskbar options, such as alignment or app badges, right-click the taskbar, choose taskbar settings, and expand the taskbar behaviors menu. Speaking of File Explorer, you can now create 7-zip and TARC files using the context menu. Right-click the file or a group of files desired, then select Compress to for all of your file compression options. Windows 11 now supports Emoji 15.1, which enables you to choose a right or left facing direction for some people emoji and introduces new emoji including a phoenix, lime, broken chain, nodding head, and a head that shakes from side to side. With this update, we address an issue that affected the ability to safely remove USB devices when Task Manager was open. This update also addresses an issue affecting the audio quality when recording videos using the snipping tool. For details on the improvements in this month's update, Read the full release notes at aka.ms slash windows11 slash release notes slash 2407. Now let's look at six quick tips to help you use File Explorer like a pro. Your files are in many places. File Explorer makes it easy to access them in one place. The easiest way to launch File Explorer is to use the keyboard shortcut Windows Logo Key plus E. By default, File Explorer will open to your home screen showing favorites, recently used files, and recommendations. If you'd rather have File Explorer open to another location, like your local PC or OneDrive, select the three dots on the ribbon, then Options. For this example, I'll change the Open File Explorer to This PC, and then select Apply. Changing how your items appear in File Explorer is easy. Just select View on the ribbon and choose to display files and folders as icons, lists, details, or other options. To reduce the space between files and folders, select View, Show, then Compact View. Want to pin one of your most used files for easy access? Right-click the file and select Add to Favorites. It will now appear under Favorites on the File Explorer homepage. You can also pin your favorite folders. Just right-click the folder and select Pin to Quick Access. Your folder will now appear on the list on the left. Do you find yourself having multiple File Explorer windows open at the same time? Tabs of File Explorer can help you reduce clutter on your screen and organize your workflow. File Explorer tabs in Windows 11 work much like the tabs in Microsoft Edge or Notepad. Select the plus sign or use Ctrl plus T keyboard shortcut to add a new tab. Already know which folder you want to see in the new tab? Right click on the folder and select Open in New Tab. Select the X to close a tab or right click on a tab for more options, like closing some or all other tabs. Moving files and folders between tabs is easy. Right click the desired file or folder, then cut or copy if you'd like to keep it in both places, then paste it into the new location. You can also select and hold the file drag it to the other tab, and drag it to the desired folder. Accidentally moved a file to the wrong spot? No problem. Just use Ctrl plus Z to undo and return the file to its previous location. If you have several tabs open, you can select and hold a tab to change the order, and use Ctrl plus Tab to navigate to the next tab, while Ctrl plus Shift plus Tab to navigate to the previous one. Are there Windows 11 features you'd like to know more about? Share your feedback by selecting one of the buttons on the bottom of the release notes page, or leave a comment on any of our videos on the Windows Community YouTube channel at aka.ms slash Windows Community on YouTube. That's it for this month. Thanks for watching.